Welcome to another episode of WW into K24. We are starting a series of matches in a tournament to decide who will be the new WW into K24 champion. In this episode, it will be Michael Jackson versus Barack Obama. I am so pumped for this match. Barack, I had fun facing you in the Fatal for Way match in episode one. I feel like we had great chemistry, and I think spells out a great friendly, yet competitive match for all our wonderful viewers out there watching. You know I can't argue that. We seem to be getting along really well, and I'm excited about this match myself. I can't wait to get started. And even if I lose, I will not behave like Joe has been towards you lately. Thank you, Barak. I really appreciate your good sportsmanship a lot. Oh, brother. You two are about to make me sick. Speak of the devil. What's up, bitches? Oh, never mind. Make that devils. I hope you and Bjork enjoyed the victory on Raw earlier this week, because the joy will end soon. Yeah, whatever you say, man. Speaking of that bitch, where is Bjork? First of all, don't call her a bitch. Secondly, Bjork will be here soon. Oh yeah, that reminds me, next week on Raw, Bjork will have a one-on-one -on -one match. Is it against me? Please tell me it's against me. No, it is not against you. It's against... Hang on, let me check my list. Um, Lara Croft. What? Are you kidding me? How would everyone sorry I'm like, how well of you think today? I was doing good until you got on. Plus, it doesn't help that I just found out I will not be able to face you on Raw next week. Me, me, me. Cry me a river. You're in Travis who looks like he ate McDonald's for every meal of the day. And can't stop crying about the 2020 election supposedly being rigged. Is talking to me about crying a river. The election was rigged, dammit, and everyone knows it. Take the L looser. Anyway, let, let us just focus on the match. It's a good one so far. What do you say so, Michael? Well, the match just started, so I think it's a little too early to say right now. But so far, it does seem promising, and I'm eager to see how it'll pan out. That is fair enough. I can't lie. I agree with you on that one. By the way, nice reversal. Thank you, Barak. Oh, my gosh. Will you to meet riding asses get a room already? and stop making out in front of us. That is total facts right there, Joe. I could have sworn Michael was dating Bjork, but it's clear now he's dating Obama now. Oh, no, me and Michael are not dating. I'm not gay, by the way. Not that I have a problem with gay people. It's just that I myself am straight, married to my wife I love dearly. Exactly, so keep talking your shit and making yourselves look stupid, El Mao. Oh shit, Michael is going up high. Damn, I gotta do something about this. I'm here to stop you from winning this match. You're not gonna be the WWE to K20 for champion if I can help it. You are about to get wrecked, son. Now take this German suplex. Joe, you asshole, I knew you were but hurt by not being able to team with Bjork and losing in the mixed tag match on Raw. But I didn't know you would be this childish over it. You want to talk about taking it down, but you yourself cannot take it down. Facts. Joe, you are nothing less than a hypocrite. You talk all that tough talk, but you don't practice what you preach. I'm not going lying. I do kind of feel bad for taking advantage of Michael getting jumped by Joe, but I really want to be the WW in the K20 for champion. You're all good, Barak. It's not your fault. I understand that you got to do what you got to do to get the win. I just hope I can manage to get a comeback after him attacking me. I believe in you, Michael. Shame on you too for your interference. Michael, tell your bitch's girlfriend to shut the fuck up. I told you not to call her a bitch. And are you talking about that, Michael? What they think? We are not dating. Yeah, we are not dating. Of course, I would not be against dating Bjork. There'd be nothing wrong with dating her either. But still, we are not dating. But you do like each other, right? I can tell by the way you two are meat riding each other. We are not meat riding each other. You're all dementia infested ass. Don't know what you're talking about. Exactly, so shut the fuck up. You're definitely meat riding him now. Have a good relationship, you guys. All right, stop talking about them being in a relationship. If they want to date each other, that's their business. If they want to fuck, that's their business. If they want to get married and start a family, that's their business. So mind your own. That was a little cringe, not gonna lie. But thank you anyway, Donald. Sure thing, Michael. I just Irish whipped Burke to the ropes. Oh shit, I think I pulled something, I hurt my knee. You take this clothesline, Michael, sorry about your knee, by the way. You're all good, Burke. It's not your fault. Why don't you kiss it to make it feel better, Burke? But no. Instead, he's adding insult to injury with a back raker. But wait, if you kiss him, his girlfriend Bjork will get mad. I'm not his girlfriend. It's a bear hug, Joe. Shit, he's breaking out. I see. You give him a hug to make him feel better, Elmao. Elmao, that's a good one, Ali. I just reversed one of your moves. And 
Now another close line for good measure in case the first one wasn't enough. I just reversed one of your moves this time, but my knee still hurts like hell. I guess that explains why Barak reversed. Another one of your moves, you're choking, bud. On the stick. What the hell? Oops, my bad. It's really amazing how we keep reversing each other's moves over and over and over again. Reversal after reversal. This is still anyone's match. Come on, Obama. You got this. Wait, you're rooting for me. I thought you did not like me. You're right. I don't like you. But I dislike Michael even more. The lesser of two evils you know. Uh, somehow I'm not surprised. Basically a pick your poison kind of thing, I guess. Yeah, something like that. All right, I think it's time to put him away with my special moves. Call this move the drawn strike. That's fucked up, Obama. I should have known you dedicate your special moves to your attacks on Yemen. Wait until you hear the name of my finisher. Oh Lord, please help us. Please don't tell me you named it what I think you named it. What do you think I named it? Hell on Yemen. Nope, that's not it. What is it then? My fucking days, Obama. What? Did you just figure it out? I think he just did the fear in Trump's eyes. I love it. You're fucked up, Obama. You hear me? Fucked up, I say. The Yemen destroyer. What the hell? I think when I landed, I hurt my knee some more. Luckily, I'm knocked out, so I won't feel it. I can just tell I'm done for. Here we go with the pen. One. Two. And three. Obama wins, and he will face the winner between myself and Ben Shapiro. I'm happy I won. I that it was due to interference, and Michael getting injured on top of that. That's why I decided that if I win the tournament and become champion, the first person I will defend it against will be Michael Jackson. Anyways, if you enjoyed this video, like, comment, and subscribe for more. Or don't. I really don't care. It's not my channel. You fucking bitch. Make sure to comment what you want to see next. Thank you, Bjork. You're welcome to